I, I had a car, I have an unfortunate tendency to leave lights on on my minivan, and then the minivan doesn't work. Now I have people, friends, who will come over and jump my car and not openly mock me. <laughs> have those people in your life. Cultivate those people. And if you don't have those people, start telling your kids, friends, parents, that you're a writer, and, and, and if they react like that's a cool thing and they seem like they might be on board, then befriend them. What's an ARC? I keep saying Advanced Reader Copy. Like they're a review copy. I've been they wondering what all reviews. Games, but they're basically review copies of books, and people feel fancy when they get ARCs. <laughs> I'm just saying, you're a writer, use it to your advantage. Mm -hmm. Lastly, and I know they're going to come yell at us in a minute, when the deadline is met, reward yourself. Relax. What worked, what didn't? Kind of debrief. Okay? Um, and then move on from there. Plan for the next time to go. Wonderful things, technology. Smartphone, Scrivener, Mac Freedom, which shuts off your internet for predetermined periods of time. Have a paper management system, because children seem to generate 17 tons of paper every week. It's so true. So we have bins. We literally have bins, and they come home from school, and their stuff goes in their bins, and I deal with it when I have time. But I know where each kid's stuff is. So at a crisis, I can find it. Um, used calendar. Online to-do lists, like Google Docs or To-Do, are great. Grocery lists, family checklists, you saw menus, wishlist.com is like an Amazon wishlist, but it's every store. And the last thing I will say, and then we'll go because someone's probably going to come and beat me. Um, you need to be kind to yourself. You're going to screw up. I hate to say that. Like, here are all my raw, raw, raw strategies. You're going to screw up. At some point, you're going to drop a ball. It's gonna ha it happened to me this week, and I had to call and renege on a commitment I had made, and I wanted to throw up. I stayed up until 4 in the morning, just blah. You have to be kind to yourself. There will be some time that you fall on your stomach. You still have a modicum of compassion for you. You wouldn't go after your friend if your friend said, Oh my God, I had to back out of this commitment that I made, and I just feel terrible. Some of you, I said that, and you, you went like this. <laughs> oh. It's okay, Erica. You would do that for a friend. Do it for yourself, okay? You're going to have that parenting moment where you snark at your kid, like, I have told you 17 times to do your math homework. And then you go back to your, your office and you're like, I am the worst parent ever. Everybody has that moment. Be kind to yourself. Forgive yourself. Promise to do better next time. And next time you will. So, that is my thing. I know we're out of time. If you have questions, please find me later. Um, and I will be happy to tell you more stories about Big Marshmallow and her capacity for chaos. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Do we have to get out of here? Could you put that list back up? I can. I might actually be in here for the next workshop.